Hi guys, this is Ratchet Zero, and we are playing Criminal Case War Edition Case 16 Fast Track to Murder. Let's unlock Chapter 2. What are these happening? It's a blizzard. Katrina, I can't see anything anymore. I can't see the train. I think we are lost. We must find shelter or we are done for. Wait, what's that? I think there's something up ahead. It's a cave. Katrina, let's hide in there and wait out the storm. Alright, short while later. Oof, this is better. When we boarded a train to follow Sobra to Mongolia, I thought that we'd end up freezing our butts off in the Siberian wilds. Well, it's Siberia, so it's cold. We have to get back to the train and keep sewing the murder of Russian diamond only Gargili at Tityako. But Shrek, this guy looks like someone's been here recently. But we're here, we may as well investigate. Alright, Kiro must have gone here. Oh, hi, bears. You're looking at the train. Oh, hope, I'm, hope I'm not gonna find any bears here in the ice cave. I mean, there's other caves, so... There are bears inside, probably. But we'll see. Bears? There's no one. Wow. Alright. Dirty trowel. Oh, I need that. Oh, right there. Uh, where's the cushion? There, high heel shoes, toilet paper, gold bars. Oh, I don't need this. Oh, I thought I needed a diamond, but diamond crate. Give me those diamonds so I can sell them because no one would pay me 20,000. They all pay me 2,000 per case. So I need some money here. The other crate picked up his full of diamonds, Katria. What the heck are diamonds doing in a cave in the middle of nowhere, Siberia? And what are the odds of a diver magnate dying on a tray right next to this cave? Something shady is going on. Let's take a look at the crate. It's true, this trowel looks out of place. Who left it and what were they planning to dig up? Let's take that dust and see what it reveals. Alright, will do. Alright, what should we do first? Uh, let's do the diamond crate first. What? Not a bowl. What the heck, Katria? How did this fruit bowl end up in the crate of diamonds you found? How did it get all bloody? Could take a dang story is over. We need to bring this fruit bowl to Lars ASAP. Alright, the snow's over. Alright, 12 hours. Now let's do this dusty trowel. It. Nice work working the trowel, Katria. Good thing we got a Mexico kit with us. Let's put this out on the lens. Alright, we'll do. Alright, let's see what's this supposed to be. Oh, turn out to be mammoth bone dust. Oh, <laughs> this kids tried to drive me crazy. Mammoth? Of course, they're dealing with mammoths in Siberia. You're the Skatsky mammoths? And you have a microscope? And my travel? Hello, it's great to be fellow mammoth enthusiast doing research. Oh, hi there. Fellow mammoth? You know what? Never mind. This is the worst and we'll need to talk to you. Alright. New guy to talk to. Of course. Alright, Vadim Efremov. Nice to meet you, Sashkatia. I saw the mammoth and I'll gladly discuss that with you over a nice dish of pelmeni. And then we'll go digging for. This is about mammoths, Mr. Efremov. We are investigating the murder of Ilya Tretyakov. Did you know him? Tretyakov? No clue who that is. Don't care. Not a mammoth, is he? We have slightly more present day eaters than mammoths. A man is dead. Mammoths are also dead, and that is the real tragedy. 
If I hear the word man with one more time, did you even notice that that was in this cave or did they slip your nose because they don't have wool and tusks? Never mind, the answer is written on your face. Let's go, Katria. We are gonna learn anything else here. Sorry about that, guys. Phone rank. <laughs> I do apologize. I do apologize. Oh, we just gotta wait for this fruit bowl to finish. Seal up it. And we are back, so let's see what's this fruit ball about. How's it hanging, Katria? Alright, alright, no need to look so serious. I'll get right back on track. And a puzzle, Lars. Give us some, some, give us some information. Fine, the witness blood was all over the fruit bowl you sent me. And what you said the damage to the bowl is consistent with the wound on the victim's head. In other words, the cure used this ball to hit the victim over the head before hanging him. Wait, that piece of curious bit to the cave since that was where that's where Katria found the ball? What's more, the witness ball was the only type from the bowl. The girl must have cut the cells on the broken bits, and wherever it is has the blood type A. Great, having you on their trail, Katria will make the curious A type blood run cold before long. I feel like we're missing something, Katia. Yeah, anyway, I've done quite a finish searching outside the train due to that snowstorm. Let's go back. Alright. Alright, we're out of cave and... Oh, bears are still watching us. <laughs> Please keep me safe from the killer. Actually, if you see him, bite him for me, but don't kill him. <laughs> Alright. Alright, let's get, just get back to outside the train, so... What do we got? Uh, rock course, uh, whistle. There, a uh, homemade bomb. A bomb? Do I need that? Oh, it's a C4 charge, right? Faded credit card? I thought I was going to say fake. <laughs> Whatever. Alright, and suitcase. The Siri out here just doesn't get old, does it? So much va variety. Snow and some more so. Alright, yeah, what you found? What the heck? There's a Cosmos logo on the credit card you picked up. I can't read the holder's name, but I'll show you'll clear it up at once. I could throw a suitcase outside the tray. Let's open it, uh, open it and find out. But also, uh, what on earth is this thing? Looks like a bomb of some kind. Let's get it to Jonah ASAP. Alright. Oh, we're already getting analysis to someone, huh? How does that take you, Jonah? 12 hours. Do it. Alright, let's do the credit card now. Oh, it's Marina's mother. Good job, Katia. So the cross was crazy if Anna outside the train belongs to Natasha Romanova. Marina's mom again? She has to be everywhere we go. Is it just me or do you also feel like there's a lot of customers in our lives lately? Correct, we need to discover what the heck Natasha is doing on this street and why she kept quiet about it. Alright. What's Maria going to say about that? No, she'll be like, who cares because she doesn't like her mother. <laughs> no! Come on. Got it. Oh. What was in the suitcase, Falcon dear? Not even a pregnancy test. That's just bizarre. Let's get to Lars. Alright. Ooh, I think I know who's going to be, but I won't say it to you guys. Alright, let's go talk to Natasha then. Mr. Marava, such good to find your credit card outside the train. Why are you here? On my way to inspect the Cosmos facility, given the compromised state of Cosmos security, I thought I'd be better check on the situation myself. I have a tight schedule, so this sort of stuff is very frustrating. I need to do but wait and eat upon many. Do you know why the train isn't moving? We're afraid there's been a murder. Ilias Vityako. Maybe you heard of him. Ilias dead? That's right, I heard of him. I knew he. He gave wonderful private donations to Cosmos. He said peace the end of that funding for us. Private donations to an organization like yours? Is that legal? He only allowed space, and he wanted money from him that was in mind to benefit Russia's exploration program. He knew it as a private citizen. 
I see. Well, Mr. Mano, if Sancho Katia has more questions for you, we'll know that where to find you. Alright, just stay on the train. Alright. Well, we still don't know if any of our suspects spoke. I uh, guess not. So, we're gonna wait for those two announced to finish. So, see you in a little bit. And we are back, so let's check out this homemade bomb. I'm not sure you laughs again. Lars and Joe should get a room, which isn't this one. And I had to remove the pawn from here before I committed another homicide. But you're not complaining about sharing with Marina? Well, she's. Uh, that is. I should get to talk about something else, Kateria. The mix inside a contraption you found contains potassium nitrate, sugar, and sodium bicarbonate. Long story short, it's a homemade smoke bomb. Smoke bombs are generally hazardous and they are not classified as weapons. They are popular among anarchists and rebels worldwide. Agrafena, yeah. Anarchists and rebels? You're right, Katia. Someone on this train matches that description exactly. Let's go another one with Agrafena as Nicola. Alright. What were you thinking uh, to do with this bomb, huh? Alright, now this pregnancy test. Hey, Katia, look what I found! A real Russian samovar. It's going to be perfect to brew my vodka in. Quelle huru! You feel disdained. Samovars are used for brewing tea, not whatever palette burning moonshine you'll cook up. That hurt, bro. The poor leave it. Lars, put the samovar away. Tell us about the pregnancy test Katia found outside the train. Ain't gonna be a long conversation. I analyze the urine on the pregnancy test, and I can tell you the test belongs to Nina Rodionova. And, as you can see from the test display, Nina's pregnant. Are we this girl is pregnant? Shouldn't mention anything about that when we talk to her. Could we also have another chat with Nina? Oh, you're pregnant, right? I knew if it was going to be her. Alright, but first let's go talk to Agrafena. Agrafena, you'd better come clean. What would you plan to do with that smoke bomb? So you found out about that, Kasaj Katria? Did you see me throwing the smoke bomb away while I was out having a cigarette? What are I'm not ashamed? That only got Tiako deserved to be shaken up a little. So you applied to attack Tiako? And earlier you said you're happy he's dead. Who else just pops you up on the suspect list? There's exactly why I threw the smoke bomb away. I know you'd misunderstand. The government types are all soulless trolls who hate freedom and fun and probably even Palmeni, which is the best food ever. You're free to take whatever you want, but if you did plan that Tiako was murder, such as you'll make sure your next meal will be in prison. Oh, you're our number one suspect. Alright, let's talk to Nina now. Mr. Diorva, can you explain why such as had a pregnancy test of yours outside the train? But I got rid of it. How did you find it, such as The truth is, I discovered I was pregnant on the train. I told Ilya I think he'd be as happy as I was, but he was furious. He said he wasn't in this relationship for the diapers. I never threw my plate of Tolmeni at him when I heard that. I was so angry I packed my suitcase to go. I'd walk all the way back to Moscow just to avoid seeing Ilya again. I put my career on hold for him, and all he cared about was his stupid cave and his stupid diamonds. What? Mr. Yola, did you say a cave with diamonds? What does did Ilya tell you about that? Oh, not you too. What do I care about caves or diamonds? I don't listen to a word he said. Well, if you remember anything, let's search Katia and know. I will keep a close eye on you in the meantime. Alright. But you don't smoke, huh? So the victim knew about the diamonds in the cave. You're right, Katia, that's very significant. None of we know how it fits to the crime yet. But let's keep it in mind for the future. Alright. Katia, I feel like we are going off the rails. We boarded this train to chase Sara to Mongolia, we are in the real route into a murder investigation. The victim, Ilya Tertiak, was a diamond magnate, and he was killed on our train near a cave stocked with suspect diamonds. With so many diamonds involved, there's gotta be a link. I saw your sister Tertiak knew about the cave, but I still don't see how this ties together. We were surprised to meet Natasha Romano on the train, but she says Tertiak donated generously to customers, so she needed him alive, not dead. I kind of hated that Yako and I was going to attack him with the smoke bomb. Snap! What? As for Nina? Wait, did you just hear something, Katria? Maybe it's just me. Anyway, on top of everything, the Burrio team is going sti still crazy and it's still freezing in this dank Sibel. What? Is it someone dressed as a bear, right? Or is it a real bear, huh? Growl! Ah! I guess it's the next chapter then. 
Oh, so that's why the beers were involved here, huh? Alright, we're gonna stop here going to keep playing chapter 3, so thank you for watching. Look, if you like this video, I'll see you again. Goodbye!